So good. And just spend these next couple moments. You don't have to turn on your ujjayi breath yet. Maybe it's just a few more moments with awareness on your breath. Knowing that any time in the 60 minutes you get overwhelmed physically, mentally, your breath is what brings you back to the moment. So use your breath to calm your thoughts. So last week, Sybil started her class and she was welcoming everyone and she said, Soul Fire is a you do you studio. And I was in her class and I was like, oh my gosh, that's all Kat and I have ever wanted to create is a space where you can come onto your mat and you can do you. Outside of these four walls, we're constantly told how to show up, who to be, what to feel, what to think, what to say. So to have these 60 minutes where I really, really want you to just do you. So if that means you stay in this pose for the whole class, that is just as courageous as the person next to you who's in handstand. I want you to use this practice to truly discover who you are, what you need. I say it all the time, this rubber mat that you're on is far more than just a rubber mat. This rubber mat is a reflection into your life. It is your greatest teacher. So use these next 60 minutes. Know that all you have to do is do you. Allow yourself to feel. I say this too. This practice is not for you to feel good or to feel bad. We come onto our mats to feel more. So feel that space of discomfort. Feel that space of resistance. Feel the fears that show up. And then see what happens when you have the freedom to do you. Take one more breath in. And one more breath out. If you can just sit and breathe and feel. The only way we will ever heal, the only way we will ever truly discover who we are is if we allow ourselves to feel. And we've become this world that doesn't love to feel. The moment we're uncomfortable, listen, I'm so guilty. I scroll Instagram to nauseam because it takes me out of the moment of feeling. So we don't have our phones here, but we have all the other distractions, the water, the towel. But what if you give yourself just a few breaths to feel the sweat dripping, to feel your heart racing? Right here, beyond the whole practice, right here is where you build resilience and you build strength. breath in and a breath out. Do that one more time. Like breath in. Like energetic let go. Oh yeah, y'all. Let's meet in down dog. You paid for an hour. I'm not going to jip you. 